biggest student-led service organization. 18 nations. 500 clubs. Tens of thousands of students. One organization. By students for students. Circle K began at Washington State University as a Kiwanis service project to help college students financially in 1936. This was two decades before the gas station. The service component blossomed around the globe. To be the leading global community service organization on college and university campuses that enriches the world one member, one child, and one community at a time. To develop college and university students into a global network of responsible citizens and leaders with a lifelong commitment to service. And all of this is sponsored by Kiwanis International, our parent organization. They also sponsor Key Club at the high school level and a whole family of service. Action Club, Builders Club, K-Kids, and several regional organizations. Circle K presents you with literally hundreds of volunteer opportunities all around campus. An event I really liked was the egg hunt because I got to play with little kids. Um, and I got to fly a kite and what else? I got a kite stuck in a tree. That was fun. Um, or like Shalom, where you you see like the community kitchen where people are so grateful for just like a hot meal um, and just things you take for granted, I think. Over, I remember over Halloween, everyone got all dressed up and we went around the neighborhood door to door and we'd fly it the day before um, just so people would know that we were coming. We were collecting money for UNICEF and we went to this random door and there was already an envelope on there um, saying two circle K with a little smiley face and had a donation in it already for us because they weren't sure they were going to be home. And I, that's just my favorite part about Circle K is just seeing the generosity, just the sheer like, caring of like all members of Bloomington. and It's, it's just always a great experience. We have an international board of a president, vice president, and nine international trustees, each representing nine different districts, all of them students. Each district, usually the size of a state or two, also has an officer board of a governor, secretary, treasurer, editor, and several lieutenant governors from each area. Finally, each club has their own board of officers, president, vice president, secretary, treasurer, bulletin editor, and lots of committee chairs. Every member can run for any position and attend plenty of conventions, from international convention to district service projects to leadership retreats. Being on the district board was a really different experience, just like talking with um, presidents of like the clubs um, from the different universities. It was, it was definitely something like I'd never done before, and I had to organize everything and you know kind of learn um, learn how to execute like what I was supposed to do. My favorite part is meeting people from the different universities because like every university is different, every club is different, so it's really cool to see like the way other clubs run their service projects, they have socials, and it's just really cool to kind of bounce ideas off of them, and, like you know, sometimes you'll take ideas from what they've done and they'll take ideas from what you've done, um, and just working together for uh, clubs working together, I think that was the coolest part of being on district board for me. Don't want to volunteer alone or with other random people you'll never see again? Well, fear no more. Circle K lets you volunteer with other club members and the Kwanis family. And we're not just about volunteering. We also get together to have fun. Usually the meetings are not like super formal, so you can still kind of chat with your friends. Like, 
find out who's going to what event and stuff like that. But after the meetings, it's also everyone hangs around and talks to each other, which is nice. You get to meet people. Like, there's a lot of people that I met through Circle K that I would not have known before. Circle K, like when we come to the meetings, we always do cheery change, and we go around, and at the end of the year, we collect all the money, and we donate it to some philosophic like organization, but what we do is we pass around the piggy, and then we tell one reason why we're cheery that day, so it's just kind of, like, it's uplifting, and it's like we all get to laugh and like encourage each other, and it's always something silly, like, oh, the weather was nice today, or I don't have exams, and you do have exams, and it's just, just being silly and interacting with others. So now that's what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. Live to serve. Love to serve.